from a car owned by the king of rock and roll. The cars that look like they're from the future. The newly remodeled BMW Zentrum Museum has it all. And Vanessa De La Vina takes us inside for an up-close look at these historical beauties. Inside the newly reopened Zentrum Museum, the history of BMW is on display through the gorgeous cars they've produced for decades. When the plant was first built in 1993-94 time frame, the Zentrum really wasn't part of the plan, but BMW felt like that we needed to have something that would show our associates and show the upstate community who BMW is. From their classic models. The first BMW, the Dixie, very incredible to see, it, you know, it's nearly 100 years old. To their futuristic electric and hybrid models. The all-electric i3, as well as the very sexy looking plug-in hybrid i8. The museum features cars you just can't help but ogle. You've probably even seen them on the big screen. We have the Z8 Roadster that was featured in the James Bond movie, The World Is Not Enough. We also had the BMW i8. That was driven by Tom Cruise in the fourth Mission Impossible movie called Ghost Protocol. But the star and center stage is the legendary BMW owned by the king of rock and roll himself. It is the actual car that Elvis Presley drove around Germany and some in the U.S. too, but around Germany while he was serving as a soldier there. Elvis bought the car back in December of 1958. It was the white color that you see here, feather white, but of course being the star that he was, he was followed by lots of female fans. Legend has it that a lot of the female fans would would take their lipstick and they would write love notes to Elvis on that white car or they would kiss the car, you know, and suddenly there's these red imprints. It was a little embarrassing to him. He decided he would paint the car red. It took two years to make the car fit for a king again. Now you can see the classic beauty in person at the Zentrum Museum, but you only have until spring of next year before the king's car leaves the building. We're very excited to have this car here. As we say, you know, Elvis is a southerner. We're glad to have Elvis back in the south. For Scene on 7, I'm Vanessa De La Vigna. These cars are so cool. Now, the Zentrum Museum is open to the public Monday through Friday from 930 to 530, and you can see it for yourself for free right next to the BMW plant in Greer.